During POW MIA Accounting Command, or JPEG, conducted forensic analysis on the remains of two sailors of the Civil War era ironclad ship USS Monitor. When the gun turret was raised, there were remains of two sailors in there, and the other 14 of the 16 missing have never been found. And what we actually can tell from this individual is this is somebody who was in his 30s, could be 30 to 40 years old. So what we have is a 17 to 24 year old white male, and we have a 30 to 34 year old white male. Out of the 16, we got it down to two. Forensics team conducted skull analysis and was able to identify some of the traits of the sailors aboard the monitor. There is a round spot right here in the teeth. And it's a little semicircle on the top and a semicircle on the bottom. That's a pipe stem groove. Back in the Civil War, a lot of sailors were smoking pipes. Louisiana State University, the Faces Lab, LSU, uh, and volunteered to do the facial reproduction. With face reproductions, it's a science and an art. So you can reconstruct it based on averages and on the expertise of whoever it is, the artist who's doing it. We have gone back and looked at many, many photographs from, of the monitor sailor sitting out on, on the deck and things like that. Hopefully we'll, we'll find out someday when we actually identify these individuals. If we get photographs of them, that would be so cool to do and make the comparison. Sailors' remains are scheduled to be interred at Arlington National Cemetery on March 8, 2013. Reporting from Joint Base Pearl Harbor Hickam, I'm Petty Officer Diana Quinlan.